We are going to Errol's first ever clear round. <laughs> It'll be a little bit scary, yeah. I think. Sorry, it's <laughs> Nice whiplash, that. You didn't really jump, though, did you? You didn't jump no. at all. Call these three three witches because all they do is just cackle. Talk, ride horses, run this. Yeah. and welcome back to another vlog welcome back to my channel today is a very exciting day isn't it Errol so today we are going to Errol's first ever clear round so his first ever proper outing he has only just put my hand in all that food um, he has only ever been to arena hires today we are heading to Meriswood like I say first ever time he's been to anything like this first time he will be going in a warm-up with lots of other horses so it's all new we are also taking tiny there he is and izzy and michaela and her pony mick are joining us so we're going for the evening so errol's just having his dinner at the minute but yeah really really exciting we'll pop in a couple of clips of some of our training sessions we've had the last few weeks and we did actually go to Meriswood last week to hire the arena because it is indoors and he had never ever been indoors uh, before then so we are going to get him ready get them loaded and head on our way Travel boots. Oh, wow. First ever pony. No pony in Iowa. Because I don't like them. <laughs> So we've just arrived at Maris Wood. I had to sit in the back because Scott went in the front. So we're here quite early. Michaela told us to get here really early. Michaela's not even here. She's not going to be oh, here for another 15 minutes. Oh, Errol's oh. knocked his hay net down. Oh, Got here early. I think we might get something to eat and then go and just have a watch and see what the course is like. And hopefully Errol's a good boy. It seems quite quiet here, which is really good for his first time. Today we are doing the 70 to 80 and the 80 to 90. We have been training bigger, but as it's his first competition, first warm up, we thought we'd keep it smaller and fingers crossed we do all right. What are your expectations for today? Um, my. What would a good day and a bad day look like? My, a you? good day would be him, be sensible in the warm up, oh. not be phased um, by the other horses in there, and hopefully to jump round both rounds, maybe not do two clear rounds. Well, ho I hope I do two clear rounds, but just to get round and not have any stops because of the pillars. Nice. Let's see how Errol's feeling. Errol, how are you feeling? Good. Good and ready. Are you good and ready? Good and ready. Okay. Izzy, Hello. you. What's going on? What are you doing? Are you doing the same thing? Uh, the 80 to 90 and the 90 to a metre. Okay, nice. The two classes. And what are, we, what are you expecting? Hoping to just go around. Just go around what? Yeah. Through them or? <laughs> yeah, just smash over through them, all of them. Okay. No, go over them. Don't mind if I have a few poles because this is bigger than I would jump. So yeah. It's not just 90 to a metre is bigger than normal. Ashley convinced me to do it. I'm yeah. not convinced, but we'll <laughs> <laughs> Well, good luck, both of you. Thanks, Scott. Yeah. Thank you. 
Meg, yeah. how's it going? Hi. What's going on? I'm a bit late. She but told it's okay. us to get here really early, so we got here really early. In my defence, it usually late. takes me half an hour to get here, and it took me 50 minutes, nearly an hour. Right, oh, mix God. on Hi. Mick. Mix on Who's Mick. in there? There's Mick. Nice. We're going to go and have a look. Oh, hello, Mick. Now. What are we doing? We're going to go and have a look at the. We're going to go and have a look at the course and see what we've got to jump. Skinny over there, nine the peacock and ten the purple. Yeah. You couldn't, okay. couldn't really uh, walk the course, could no, you? No, because they're still going and then when they change the course we've got to be on and warming up. But it's quite a simple course, it's just sort of a figure of eight because it's a clear round, they don't really make it too complicated. The course, which is perfect for Errol's first time, it seems very chilled, very laid back, not too many people, so I think perfect for his for his first time just watched that pony so we need to, <laughs> to know which way <laughs> back. Uh, right, that was a bit awkward but yes yeah, so we're just walking back now we're going to get him tacked up me get ready get on and warm up and fingers crossed he's okay and doesn't get too overexcited or overwhelmed by the atmosphere we're going to go and get him tacked up <laughs> Errol, you've got to come out Oh, yes, oh, yeah. we have the same name. Nick. No, it's not on purpose. <laughs> Everyone always goes, Did you name yours? I'm just like, No, I didn't. Yeah. It came with the name Mick. Got it. This show name is actually my Mick, so it's quite cute. But yeah. No. I hate it when people do that. <laughs> one, two, three, off. Okay. One, two, three, off. <laughs> you didn't really jump though, did you? You went like this. Bloody hell. Harold. Oh, it's a cute little, cutest little winning, isn't it? Safety first when it comes to the well, he is actually five, but he's just quite sharp, so... Safety first, kids. Safety first. Yep. You all good, Ash? Feeling okay. Oh. 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 Yeah. Hopefully it's okay. Good boy. <laughs> Stop. Stop. He seems to have calmed down now I'm on. Yeah. That was the best thing, he was just getting a bit... It was getting a bit wild. A bit, a bit wired, but it's just, it's just there's a lot going on. He's not used to it. There's a lot of horses moving around the place. You know, and this is the whole point coming out here is he's got to get used to this, ready for when, you know, he goes out eventing eventually. So Yeah, this is all good experience exactly. for him. Just, he's looking at everything. Looking at everything. We're just going to try and get him out to as many of these sort of places that still, there's not loads and loads going on, but there is more going on than he's used to. Yeah, come on. Come on, so come on. We have to wait for Michaela, but where she is. How are you feeling then? Nervous? Uh, just uh, app apprehensive to see how he feels with all the horses, you know, going around him when he goes into that arena on his own. He's just pooing. Oh. Nervous poo. Oh, nervous poo. Oh, there's Michaela. Nervous poo, and there's Sorry, Michaela. Sorry, get out. Uh, lovely, brilliant, go and warm yourselves up. Good boy, thank you. When did you get married, Ashley? Last July. This is my lovely husband. Oh, yeah, you're right. Sorry, I'm the source of the confusion with the names, so. <laughs> it's your fault, Scott. It yeah. is all my fault. A lot of things are my fault, yeah. mate, now. <laughs> right, mix up first. If she can remember where she's going. <laughs> <laughs> You'll do great.
Are you going now? How are you feeling, Ash? Uh, well, he Good really boy. did settle, but now he's got to go into another new environment. Um, so it's going to be a little bit scary, yeah. I think, but he's doing well. Good boy. It's okay. Let me understand now. Touch him, does he? No, no, that was just. I think if that hadn't been a skinny, I don't think he would have had that down. Just, he needs to do it quite a few more Good times. Good boy. Just wear, wear green, but it's going to be tired tomorrow, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Even Good the warm up was tiring. Oh, I'm a bit half breath. The thing is, he responded to everything I asked. Every time I put my leg on, he went, "Okay, I'll go for you." Maybe it just felt a bit more not. Wasn't much rhythm to it, but that's he was just looking. But he was always going to go. He was calling a lot because he was like. Why am I in here on my own? <laughs> like, he's been fine when we've gone to uh, our lessons with Nick and he's on his own, but he goes straight in on his own and he'd obviously gone, look, didn't, done the warm up with like 10 other horses, got used to that. Then all of a sudden you go in the arena and because it's maybe is a bit harder because it's indoor, you can't then see any other yeah. horses. So then he was all of a sudden, he was like, well, what's going on now? I yeah. was with all these horses and now I'm not, but... I think he's dealt really well with it. He's not really done. You should be proud of yourself. I'm really pleased yeah. with that. Well done. Because also, I actually, I wa it wasn't as small as I thought it was going to be. It was a bit, it wasn't big, but yeah. Yeah. you know what I mean? Chuff with him. Good really boy. pleased. Good boy. I'm just pleased he went in and he just he listened to me all in the warm up, in the ring. He's, he's really, he's really tried and that's all we can ask from him, really. Yes. Oh. He's so tired. He's so tired and he's got to go again. Oh, he was closing his eyes a bit more a minute ago. Oh, oh, he's tired. Yeah, we're on again. We're going we're on, higher. We're going time. to 80 to 90 this time. Yeah. But I'm going to try and stay in canter, I think, this time now yeah. that I've been in there. You didn't jump at all. Right, we've got Tiny here. We've got Errol. Yeah. He's ready. For, Errol looks like he's ready for bed. Errol now. is ready for bed. <laughs> that mentally was a lot for him. <laughs> and now he's about to get higher. Yeah, but hopefully I don't need to do that much warm up. Just jump the jumps a few times and go in so that he doesn't get any more tired. <laughs> <laughs> He'll wake up, I'm sure. Very tired. How are you feeling? I'm feeling fine. I just hope I can G him up a bit. He's actually feeling Come on. tired. But Come on. Take your time in there. Yeah. Don't start until you feel he's constantly. Yeah. Yeah.
Such a shame because I think he just went in there. He was tired. In hindsight, maybe should have just done the bomb round. But it's good he's got to do that. And then he was tired and not switched on. <laughs> then he scared himself a bit because he kind of crashed through a couple. But I'm really pleased. No, we'll leave all of that in the vlog. I know it wasn't pretty, was it? But no, it wasn't. Um, well, I got him going again, and I then went round. Actually, the rest of it clear. Yeah. Um, he was just tired and switched off, so just shows we need to do it more. Yeah. But it's annoying because the height's not an issue. Height was fine. Just went in there, and I think that's a lesson learned. I needed to switch him up, switch him on. Sorry, in the warm up a bit more, because then once he switched on a bit, he was better. Did he look tired? No. I felt really, like I was proper having to ride into every fence. I'm really pleased with both of us how we then re kind of started from two again though. Well done. Okay, thank well done. you. bar the first he jumped everything else really nicely yeah. you, you jumped the skinny really nicely because yeah. you waited for the deeper spot I waited I was like because if you I yeah if you had gone yeah. normally yeah. you push and then that's when he goes flat because he's a thoroughbred so we he's more inclined to jump long and flat so I thought that was really good yeah I thought your count was so much better in the second half and then he just sat up yeah. jumped through the double I then had the count yeah well. yeah, yeah. Um, right, well done. No, I, I think we all smashed yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, now you can do another one. Guys, yeah. hate to be the one to brag, but I'm the only one with a rosette. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh no, you've weed and we've got to move all of our stuff this week. Scott. Mm. Guys, we have to move house and we're using this trailer and he's weed. So that's nice, isn't it? Just wash him down. That was the biggest round she's ever jumped, so I think that was really good. Well done. Well done. Thank you. The first down was a, was a bit annoying. Is it the, was it the sun? You had the same sort of jump down? The sun, and I do think, I know you're going to shout at me, but I partly do think that's why Errol, the sun is really just coming down on that oh. one through the slats. 
um, I thought the skinny he had down, that was just really annoying. You actually rode that really nice and he just tapped it. He just tapped it. Literally just tapped it. But you, when you say to him that like, a couple of times, you then, you wanted to go along and he got in deep and you went, oh, sorry, he is so much better going on that yeah. deep. You need to just, I think because it was a bit bigger then, you I'm kind of panicked me. a little yeah, bit. I did. Oh, yeah. If you could just sit and wait for those ones, because actually he did oh, help you so out, but then careful. he's really careful. Yeah. I think it was really good. Yeah, I'm happy. It's the biggest you've jumped yeah. as well. So well I think, done. yeah. Amazing job. Smashed it. Yeah. Thanks. He looked really good, I thought. Right, the star of the day, Mick on Mick. Just going to walk around with this on. Little Rosette there. This old boy is a star of the day, aren't you? Such a good boy. Girls, why don't you put. Why do you put your rosettes on your, yeah. on your top? <laughs> uh, oh, wait. <laughs> right, Ash, do you want to do a sign off with the three witches here? Okay. Go and do a sign Can off. Can you explain that you call us the three witches? Yeah, I call these three, well, three witches because all they do is just cackle <laughs> all day, all night. Talk, ride horses, run this yeah, constantly in your ear do. like that. <laughs> We do run that a lot. Battery, battery's literally about to die. You've got to do okay. it. Okay. Mick, get over here. Go, go, go. Thank go. you very much, guys, for watching. Um, obviously, Mick did a great clear <laughs> round. Me, not so much, but it was Errol's no, first was time out. Good. No, I'm really, really pleased with his first round and how he coped in the warm up. And I'm really pleased in the second round how we recovered. The first few bits weren't ideal, but it's all about learning with young horses. So I'm really pleased with how it finished. Mm -hmm. And it just shows we've just got to get out do some more um, and it will just become more normal to him thought Izzy did a really good job uh, her first time jumping 90 to a meter did great um, and he yeah he jumped really really well yeah. um, what so, part yeah. of battery dying don't you understand we don't yeah. want my story. sorry so thank you very much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed watching this especially watching Errol go out for his first ever time because you guys have seen from when we backed him hope you guys enjoyed it and we will see you for the next one